Hello. Today our topic is cognitive form. Cognitive forms is the online form builder that uniquely balances powerful capabilities with ease of use. This enables anyone to take their complicated or time-consuming processes and make them simple. Get started quickly using our free form templates and drag and drop from builder to create beautiful forms. Open the browser, type cognitive form and enter. Select the cognitive form website, the page will open. Just click the sign up for free button. Just sign up with Google as well as Facebook. I can proceed sign up with Google account. Now the home page is directly appearing on the screen. Now on the left side of the screen we can add a new form. Drop down and we see start from scratch option and choose template option. Here is option of all forms, recent option, start. After upgrade you can create folders to organize your forms. Click in new form, a window will appear. Here we can see many options. On the top of the page there is option of builder, publish and entries. Here we can add one more form. In form setting we can change the title of the page. Now we will change the title name to MS by Ames. Here now you can see the title of Ames is now our page. After that we put the description on our page in which I was going to write except first name. I was going to write except first time design. So this is an easy way to make our form easy. From here we have other options which we can do one by one. Now in the middle of our page there is a size of plus. After clicking on this icon on the left side we can see many fields in which the textbook has written voice addresses, phone number and many other such fields. I see we can pick up any of these fields and put them on our page. After that below the field we see the layout and option within which we are seeing many options including the content section and many more options. You can save it by putting it inside and you can also make it free. Then if we look to our left we have the text option if we press it and bring it to the center of our screen we have it fit inside the screen as soon as we click it we have the name option will start appearing in the middle of the screen with our first name and last name. Also we can change the name of our text on the left side and put more things inside it. And we can use help text inside it and also many fields inside it we can put. After that when we click on the plus sign then we can reuse any field from the side field from the side key field as now I am using the address field and placing it in the middle of the screen. The pass comes with many options to use. Now on the left side I can change my address label and then I can use the type of it to do whatever I want to do on my end. I can use it on the US or international level, use both. While I can see the difference between them, I can add a lot more things to it and change a lot of things inside it. Also after clicking on the plus sign, I am going to add the phone label inside my screen as soon as I add the phone field. Then on the left side, it starts to see me add it. By doing this, I have added the email bio into it and then I have added the website into it. Clicking on the plus sign and clicking on page break in layout on the left side. After clicking on page break, you will have a field settings break show. Within the field settings, we can also copy it, sometimes delete it and insert it according to your choice. When we click on insert button, we have two options, one insert above and, what the, and the other insert below. Now we can use any of the two options as we want. So many more fields I can put in it. Like now I am adding a currency field to it. And then exactly like that I have added a signature field to it. Now I, now I am adding, I am putting in the layout which is the page break. Which is very easy to get stuck in the middle of the page. Now I see the option for next layout. I put the element inside it. You can use it more by looking in turn. Further, as soon as I clicked the when on to number of the layout, a screen opens in which I can add many things. 
what kind of option can I start with the last name in addition I have added another person and given him the name of one and the last name and by adding another field I have given the option of this medium if you have saved it it's very easy way to add content to your page further after that I have clicked on the plus sign and put it and put one on the page inside it and then I have added another field inside it and uploaded the file as soon as I have used this file inside it yes there is a message in it which is telling that the folder is unavailable to this option as soon as I tried the signature why it does not give the option and then it gives the option of ok and then more the thing I have created is on the top of my page I use the free preview option to see it like on fairy tales I can see that the title of my page at the top of at the top is MS by aims and description are also shown below of title under the description I can see send me page number one and page three and four I have got a lot going on under the fields I have added you can see inside the page first name in the number in which I am putting my name as Maria in the second field I put my name Abbas and in the address which is my address I put it according to my address city state its postal code its country everything I can fill my address condition by entering then I have entered the phone number and I have entered the untitled key in it after that I put the email I want to put in it and after that I will put the website if I want to put otherwise I will go to the next page by clicking on the next option I can easily go to the next page by adding my own signature and any of these titles as soon as I go to the next page as soon as I enter my signature here I see the option of file on which I can upload by clicking on top anyone can track my file inside my phone and the file is safe fearing which patch I am going to yes I see sub match option as soon as I click on submitted option if so I see a thank you filing and nation option after submit the form finally all the things on my phone that I put in it are done and recorded from more after wrapping up I can come back to my page and comfortably publish my form in the page in the option above you can and it has entry speed on the left side I have an option where I can create another form by clicking on the option so this is a very easy way to customize the form can use and create within it we are given the facilities that we can use more pages to create our form within it and within this tutorial I have created three pages within three pages I had a lot of turquoise if I look at the bottom of the given screen there I see many options in which after setting there is a payment option as soon as I click on it a payment account box appears in front of me most of the accounts I see have options for pay free trap and Shopify any of them I can use as soon as I choose as soon as I close it then next I see a submission setting option within which I can do more custom setting and put things in and customize and I can also fill it out like this and save and publish can make things so that was our lesson today that we have got to learn in a lot in that we use two or two to three rows of our own to put a lot of stuff inside it has been developed by giving page break option in one to three so we can use this thing in many ways and make it according to our own hoping that you can use it today if you have any questions you can ask questions in the comment section i hope you enjoyed tutorial and learned more things by this stay safe and take care